Welcome back. This is day two of duct tape wart removal. And I wanted to show you, we just took off the band-aids, washed his hands and let them dry out a little bit. I want to show you the um, how we've progressed. And surprisingly, I was a little bit skeptical whether it would actually work. It has actually um, gotten smaller on all of the fingers. This is the second one. And then this one on the palm. This is the one that we, we changed our method and we used a freeze, a freezing method on this one because it was difficult to keep the um, duct tape and band-aid on that one. And then we have one more to show you is on this finger, this pointer finger. It's right right there and this one actually shrunk the most. So what I wanted to show you is what, how, what we do before we put the duct tape on. I forgot to show this to you yesterday. And can you just hold this? Can you see? So what we do is we um, just take a, a nail file and we're going to just lightly file the wart to get the dead skin cells off. If it starts to hurt, that's when you should be done. Okay, so we're done with that one. What we're going to do now is we're going to take a piece of duct tape that I cut ahead of time and I'm just going to put it on top of the wart. <clears throat> and then I'm going to take a band-aid and put this on top of the duct tape just so that just to keep it from falling off and don't you don't want to do it too tight you want to be able to move your fingers and that's it we will check back in with you tomorrow and give you more update more progress on the duct tape wart removal method thanks